so close passage now close passage like i keep saying it's all about context so if you read the context quickly you will have an idea of identifying associated words that are needed for the blank then another strategy that we do always is to look for words before and after the blank right try and pay attention to uh, if the sentence is giving a positive or negative meaning um the same strategies that we apply for fill in the blanks right there could be some things pertaining to grammar which we need to pay attention to things like that so let's look at this how the domestication of animals began is not known perhaps there were large numbers of animals in areas near water where men also were dash here man could observe uh, the animals and study their habits and this knowledge must have dash him to tame them it was again easy for and dash people to domesticate animals and feed them on the husks of the grain that were left after threshing in any event sheep and goats pigs and cattle and later horses in a sets asses were tamed and kept in pens man thus dash food from the soil and also from animals in the pens the animals could be observed even more closely calves suckling milk must have given man the idea that he too could get food other than meat from cows and goats this practice which combines agriculture with the raising of animals is known as dash farming animals however were chiefly used to provide meat and milk they were yet to be used as beasts of burden or draw the plow okay where men also were options uh, obtained gained achieved okay let's look at the uh, answer options here so how the domestication of animals began is not known perhaps there were large number of animals in areas near water where men also were dash so attained to attain something means to get something that's not the meaning that the context is saying men also were obtained maybe because gained doesn't make sense gained is to take advantage of right i gained something i i received something so gained what it's incomplete i can't use option c option d achieved again what did they achieve it's almost like attained attained gained achieved all but obtained seems to be pretty much the closest from at least the given options here man could observe the animals and study their habits and this knowledge must have dash him to tame them so given the context right all these three attained what gained what achieved what not clear in the context but obtained seems to be the closest that makes logical sense so men also were obtained here man could observe the animals and study their habits and this knowledge must have must have so i have have which means i need the uh, third person but all my options are in the third person as in a uh, third verb rendered enabled authorized modified so he's been observing the animals right and their where they live studying their habits their habitat so because of this reason it has helped him right helped him to tame them so help if i have to substitute my own word in blank too it will be enabled him made him right not rendered rendered means what rendered mean to submit or present you know either for approval or consideration or payment like render an opinion or render a bill incorrect right enabled him to tame them not authorized not modified lebesish not authorized him authorized uh when you authorize someone you're giving them permission right or you're holding them uh, responsible for something in this context it just says because he's been observing the animals and studying their habitat he is able to do enabled him means given him the opportunity to do this which is to tame them it was again easy for an see the third one is pretty easy because of the there's a hint word can somebody quickly identify the hint word an i have an indefinite article which means i need a word that starts with vowel from the options which is the word that starts with vowel agricultural not b business not rural r not farming f and also in the context if you see it says people to domesticate animals and feed them on the husks of the grain that were left after threshing so it was easy again for who who can do this whose work is this does a businessman do this a rural person yes maybe but then i have an for and farming people rural people doesn't ring well right as collocations adjective plus um noun collocations agricultural people agricultural this is your adjective right here right for and agricultural people so one it is aligned with the indefinite article and so i need a vowel one 
Two is domesticating animals, feeding them on the husks of the grain that were left after threshing. All this work, agricultural, agriculturalist does. Right? So that's the answer. Option A. Fourth one. Man thus dashed food from the soil. So man thus joined food, united food, blended food, mixed food. What's the answer? Here we're looking at man kind of um, combining agriculture with the raising of the animals. Right? So obviously it has to be man thus he mixed food from the soil and also from the animals. In the pens animals could be observed even more closely blah 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 all of that okay. And then you have a, another clue right. There will be some clue words in the context. This practice which combines agriculture with the raising of animals is known as what farming options concentrated intensified strengthened amassed. It's not intensified not heightening right intensify means to to heighten strengthen not really when i say blending something i'm imagining you know you're making it to one composite mixture right when you're blending something like i'm immediately the picture of a blender is coming to mind it becomes one composite mixture but not necessarily that he is blending it actually you know it's not like he's taking plants and animals and putting it together and and what's the meaning of amassed anybody to amass something means what See, uh, you can amass a fortune, right? Or you can amass some sort of an evidence where you're collecting or you're accumulating. Amass means to accumulate, right? Here, we are only talking about how he is integrating or combining uh, both the food from the soil and from the animals. Not necessarily that he is blending them together, right? It's a combination of two. So, the right word, the most effective word, would be mixed. He's mixing both of them. When you say mix, don't literally think of it as, you know, it's a, it's a good mix of, it's a good combination of this and that. Not necessarily that he's taking both those entities and putting them in a... When I say mixed, man thus mixed food from the soil from animals, it's a combination of both those elements, both those entities. Yeah? Yeah. Concentrated, intensified, strengthened and amassed. The last word, the last one is, you need a word that is uh, talking about where you're converging or you're bringing together, like you're meeting both agriculture and the raising of animals is known as, the right word is actually concentrated, right? When I say something is concentrated, I'm talking about when you're bringing both the entities together, you're converging both agriculture and the raising of animals and you're bringing it to a common center. So it's called concentrated farming. Animals, however, were blah, 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 were chiefly used to provide meat and milk. They were yet to be used as beasts to burden or draw the plow. plow. Yeah, so the answer is not amassed. Chandra, see, usually uh, when I say amass, just to give you, I will immediately relate to it with, you know, you amass either some sort of an evidence or you amass a fortune where you're talking about you are accumulating a large quantity when it comes to a fortune or when you're amassing evidence means you're gathering. But here we are talking about two entities coming together which is agriculture and raising of animals. So when I say something is concentrated, we're talking about both these converging, right? Something is strengthened means something is made strong. Yeah, 